Now think twice before using some four-letter words in public. A local mother is facing charges tonight after a witness says she used profanity toward her children. News Channel 6's Dion Guillory talked exclusively to the mother to get her side of the story, and he's here now. Now, Brad, comedian George Carlin became famous for his bit about the seven words you can never say on TV. Now it seems you can't say those words in public either. One mother says the claims against her are false and a big misunderstanding. Well, you're under arrest. Right in front of my kids, in front of my husband, in front of customers. Danielle Wolf recalls the night she was arrested and charged with disorderly conduct at this Kroger in North Augusta. She says a woman shopping in the store followed Wolf and her family. And she's like, you said the F word. But, like, she said it, and I'm like, when did I say this to my kids? According to the incident report, Danielle Wolf was here shopping at this Kroger with her kids going down the bread aisle when they kept squeezing the bread, and that's when she said the word that got her arrested. It seems a little extreme. That we don't guide our children in the proper way. But Wolf says that's not what happened. She was like, you told that she was they were smashing the bread. I said, no, I said it to my husband that he was smashing the bread by throwing the frozen pizzas on top of it. According to North Augusta law, disorderly conduct generally means to utter while in a state of anger in the presence of another any body, lewd or obscene words or epithets. Wolf says the woman later said she didn't want her arrested, but it was too late. I didn't harm nobody. I didn't hurt nobody. The lady said she was having a bad day. So because you're having a bad day, you're going to ruin somebody's life. Though North Augusta Public Safety provided me with a copy of that law, none of them wanted to comment on the case. And just moments ago, I spoke with the woman who said she witnessed this incident. She tells me she saw Wolf use the F word repeatedly, and she started cursing at her after she approached her. The woman says she wasn't having a bad day, and that hearing Wolf use those words brought her back to her abusive childhood. Wolf is due in court on September 12th.